Hello everyone, my name is Ali Star, and welcome to one of the most, if not the most, anticipated games of this year. The game that everybody is talking about, and that game is Bug Snacks. But all jokes aside, I'm really excited to play this game at long last. When it was revealed at that PlayStation 5 live stream, amongst other games like Spider-Man Miles and Morales and Horizon 2, Forbidden West and Ratchet and Clank, like I think it just caught everyone else off guard because of how quirky and cutesy this game was compared to all those other games so but honestly I think because of that it's kind of stuck around and because of how charming and original this game is and you know I'm not gonna lie that character of Benito song is still stuck in my head to this day so <laughs> but I should mention that the PlayStation 5 version of this game is one of the free games that you can get for this month if you have a PlayStation Plus membership so if you have a playstation 5 and you want to try this game uh i think you have until like january of next year to grab it but anyways we're going to be playing this game story uh we're going to play for a little bit see how it is uh get a feel for everything and if you guys enjoyed this game so much that you would like to see a series out of it please sure to let me know you know that will help me gauge interest and i would love to continue on uh, within the coming weeks, so. But anyways, let's just jump right in, shall we? All right, looks like we're com commandeering a, uh, I wanna say it's an airship? Okay, cool, there's our cute little island, and oh, that's a cute little hand-drawn map, too. Oh, no. Uh-oh, that's not good. Okay, uh, move the right stick to look around, okay. And uh, move the left stick to walk. All right, cool. All right, let's go into this weird cave where that spider just crawled out of some skeletal remains. Okay, that's uh, that's cool. I like it. I dig it. I guess. Okay, cool. Whoa, things are happening already. Wow. You know, I didn't really expect something so dire for a game that just looks so cutesy. Okay, click the lift stick to run. Okay then, uh, I guess there's no turning back. We'll just have to keep moving. Okay then. Ooh. There's things in the bushes that are rustling. Uh, can I investigate these or not? No, nope. we're just gonna, you know, do a little flopping. I'm just gonna, you know, do a little dance. Okay, that that's the thing that knocked us out. Oh no! Uh oh. Oof. Ow, that's gotta hurt, man. Oh, two weeks earlier. Are we rolling? <clears throat> Greetings! I am Lisbeth Megafig, intrepid explorer, seeker of the unknown, hunter of undiscovered creatures. <laughs> She's a real... Aw, that's really cute. <laughs> what? The people deserve to know. You're the only one who gets to know. Aw, cute. <clears throat> I'm Lisbeth, and I have made an incredible discovery here on Snacktooth Island. But this is more than a mere expedition. My followers and I have started building a new... I'm kind of curious. Did they shoot this on an old, like, Lumiere well camera? Like in the 1920s? <laughs> Kinda get that vibe for some reason. Could tempt us to start a new life in the untamed wild? Bug snacks. They're the most delicious thing in the world. You haven't lived until you've tried one. Is it's that so? True. Half bug, half snack. There's nothing quite like them. There's one now. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Good effort, Bilbo. As for you. I'm sure you're wondering why I've sent you this film. I've read your work. The Shadow of Grumpfoot, The Secret of Soylent Grump, Stella. Soylent Grump. <laughs> like me, you have a passion for discovering unknown truth. 
and also like me, do you truly recognize your talent? Hmm. You are just the Grampus I need to share my story with the world. I've sent you a map to our settlement. Come to Snack Tooth Island. Alright, cool. You and I will share the incredible tale. I guess I'm going on a investigative journey to find some bug snacks. Okay. Uh press square to, on somebody to talk. Okay, uh it looks like I'm in the office of C Clumby Clumbernut. <laughs> And I have a report here that says bug snacks demystified draft 12. All right, uh, let's talk to Clumby. Wow, that's your new lead? Another monster hunt? Do you have any idea how much trouble you've caused me? Wait, what did I do? I had to recall half a million papers and give a public apology. All because your grump foot turned out to be a lost football mascot. <laughs> We've been over this. It doesn't matter how eye-catching your articles are if I'm stuck cleaning up your sloppy work. Mm. You're already out of second chances. And now you're going to follow Elizabeth to some grump forsaken island? Elizabeth Megafig is either a con artist or a lunatic. Uh, Remember that whole mess with Grumplantis? Grumplantis. <laughs> this bug's next thing is just her latest delusion. I don't know. Grumplantis seems nice, to be honest. Oh, it looks like I have dialogue options. Uh, why don't you believe in bug snacks? Oh, yeah, why don't you believe in bug snacks? Because I've got a working brain. Okay, uh, fair enough, I guess. Uh, okay, what's wrong with Snack Tooth Island? Do your research. Ships go missing around there all the time. The place is like me before I get my coffee. Deadly. Um, okay. Uh, what do you know about Lisbert? She got a little famous after stumbling across some forgotten civilization in Grumpsylvania. Grumpsylvania. She's been coasting off that success ever since. Uh, so does that mean there were, like, vampire grumpuses or something like that? Or remains of vampire grumpuses? Okay, whatever. Uh, well, I'm going. This is absurd. Only a desperate loser would follow Lisbert. Oh, jeez, thanks. Well. It is a tantalizing story, if true. We'll just have to hear it from Lisbert herself. Say you get an interview with her and make it back alive. You just might keep your job. Okay. Now get going and try not to fall off a cliff or something. Um, about that. Uh, that's, you know, that's funny. I, uh, I happen to just <laughs> fall off this little small cliff right here and hit my head on a rock. All right. Cool. Oh, hey, look at that little person. Let me talk to him real quick. See if he's all right. Lisbert, is that you? Oh, thank Grump you're alive. Too bad I'm dying, though. <laughs> all right, who are you? What? Oh, it's me, Philbo. Philbo. You know, Philbo sounds like the amalgamation of, like, Frodo and Bilbo Baggins from the Lord of the Rings. <laughs> I don't know. That's just what immediately pops in my head. Uh, what happened? I was looking for you, but uh, I got hungry and I couldn't catch any bug snacks. That's... All right, stay with me, buddy. Uh, where's Lisbert? What? That's a weird question, Lisbert. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. You're not Lisbert. Oh, Grump. It doesn't matter who you are. Please get me something to eat. Okay. Uh, sure thing, buddy. Hooray! Oh. <laughs> um, I think there's a bug snack right over there. Could you get a good look at it? Find out which one it is for me. Uh, sure. Okay. Um, okay, click R3 to open the snack scope. Okay. And I can zoom with the triggers. Oh, whoa. That's pretty cool. The, um, the controller is vibrating every time I'm, like, zooming in and out with the camera. Scope. Anyways. Okay, it's a strawby. A very simple snack. Watch its walking pattern. They're a little shy, but that's okay. They just need some space. Alright, cool. I scanned a strawby. Oh, oh, good. That, that one's pretty easy to catch. Well, uh, you aren't me, anyway. <laughs> okay, do me a favor and take my snack trap. Alright, cool. You don't have your snap track selected. Oh, Its tracks sure. come out of this bush. Put the snack trap down there, and then we'll hide. All right. Uh, you don't have your snap track selected. Hold L1 and point at the snack trap to select it. Okay. It's okay, buddy. 
Oh, I went to hiding. Anyways. Right. Go ahead and put the stuff. This rock. Okay. Is it gonna come out? And uh, nice. there we go. Pick it up before it escapes. Okay, uh spark. Okay, cool. Kinda like the music when you catch one of these. That's pretty cool. Uh anyways, talk. Wow, you got it! Okay, now toss it into my mouth hole. Uh, that is a really weird to say to describe your mouth, but okay, I'll, uh, I'll oblige, I guess. Okay. Uh, open wide. Uh, awesome. there you go. You got a little strawberry oh, arm yes. thing. I'm saved. Uh, what happened to your arm? <laughs> oh, this? Pretty neat, huh? It's a side effect of eating bug snacks. Anywho, I'm still recovering. I could use maybe three more bug snacks. I'm sure that scope of yours will come in handy. Skin and plan, I always say. Okay, cool. All right, we're gonna grab more bug snacks. Uh, let's go to this cave area. This looks kind of interesting. Oh, okay, we got a nice little oasis, and we got a, what is that? Uh, it's a rootle. It burrows into the soil when scared. Um, same, rootle, same. Okay. All right, cool. Uh, all right. Oh, wait. Can I scan this statue thing? Strange statue. These statues must be hundreds of years old. Okay. All right, let me get my little trap out. And I'm going to wait for it to burrow out. And I'm going to catch it. Pick that trap up. All right, cool. We got a rudol. Okay, and then we gotta find two more for uh, Mr. Philbo Baggins, as I'd like to call him. Oh, what is, where are these? A green olive. Oh, it's like an olive, okay. Uh, latches onto snacks and traps it with its unsettlingly long tongue. I also like that how they repeat their names too, like Pokemon. <laughs> Kinda cute. All right, uh, here's another brutal. I guess we could try grabbing this thing again. It's okay, little buddy. Just wanna, just gonna go ahead and put this there. Oh. Oh no! Hey, give that back. You've lost your snack trap. Open tool select and press R1 to retrieve it. Uh. Okay. So that like destroys it, I guess. Hmm. It's gonna be a little harder than I thought it'd be. Come on, little guy. There we go. All right, got the Ruto. This looks blocked off. Okay, I can't go there. Maybe I missed something back here. Oh, yeah, there's, a, there's another strawberry. Let's go ahead and put that there. Just wait for it to pop out real quick. There we go, all right. Grabbing it. Okay. All right, cool. We got our snacks, and we just gotta go back to Philbo and uh, feed him. Quick. All right, there you go. There's your strawberry. Okay, you got a little strawberry leg. Interesting. A carrot leg. And a carrot arm. Okay. You Interesting. You are a lifesaver, buddy. Sorry, I was too busy dying to introduce myself. <laughs> I'm Philbo Fiddlepie. I'm the uh, mayor around here. Oh, okay. Um, sorry if this is a stupid question, but uh, what are you doing out here? Uh, Elizabeth Megafed asked me to join her. I'm here to escape bugs. This is my last chance to find a good story. Uh. Oh, you got the film. I helped Lizbert make that. Oh. I know who you are. You're the journalist. I knew it was stupid to ask. Okay. Lisbert said you'd be coming. Hmm, you're a bit late though. Uh, still, it's my job to show you the way to town. Follow me. Okay. All right. Take me to town, Philbo. And you just look weird walking like that with your fruity and veggie appendages. It kind of freaks me out, to be honest. Buddy, I have to tell you something. I'm supposed to take you home, but 
Lisbert might not be there. Oh, okay. Uh, where is Lisbert? Why are you sad? I don't know where Lisbert is. I was out here looking for her. But who knows? Maybe she will be there when we get back. I'm sure she wouldn't want to miss her interview with you. Ready to go, buddy? Uh, yeah, let's go then. All right. Through here. Yeah. All right, yeah. Bust through that bush. All right, cool. Going into the garden grove. Oh, hey, there's a there's a dude uh, tending to a garden. It seems like. Hey, Wimbus. How's the farm? <laughs> You're still alive. Thought you'd have starved to death by now. Nope. <laughs> I found a journalist. They're also pretty good at hunting bug snacks. I was gonna bring them back to Snacksburg. That's nice. Don't you wanna come with? No. Why not? I got my paws full with my ketchup crop. Without Lisbert around to catch bug snacks, I gotta keep us all fed. Uh, hmm. we can't just eat ketchup. Well, it's better than nothing. You want us to die out here? No, no, but, uh, but this garden is just so far away from everybody. Maybe you could start another one in town? Call this one quits? I don't quit. This guy seems very crunchy. I leave and take a ketchup for the road. Oh. <laughs> oh, darn bunger. Get out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, stranger, I could use your help. This bunger goes wild for ketchup. Oh, yeah, it does. There's a pen set up nearby. Take my saw slinger, gather up some ketchup, and use it to lead the bunger over yonder. Oh, okay. Uh, cool. So I got a slingshot of sorts. Um, okay. Uh, can I grab these? Okay, press square on nearby sauces to pick them up. Alright, give me all the ketchup. I'm gonna hoard them like I used to do when I was a kid. There we go. Alright, All right, back in the pen. Come on. Oh, come on. Come on, just follow the ketchup trail. There you go. All right, cool. We caught a bunger. I took Thanks, care of that stranger. bunger. We better go check on Philbo. Yeah, I guess. Uh, hope he's doing well. Oh, there he is. Um, <laughs> seems to have um put a crack in that tree. <laughs> Uh, are you alright, Fimbo? Don't go to sleep. You're probably concussed. Oh, uh, don't you worry. I'm a, I'm a little sore, but uh, I'll be a okay. Okay, if you just happy say so. Along with Wambus, he's having a hard time, and his wife isn't around much these days. Oh. So uh, just see that's if you can help him out. I'll stay here until my that's brain never stops good. hurting. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, stranger. I didn't mean for Philbo to get hurt. He's right, though. I'm in over my head. I know farming would be easier back in town. And those shishka bugs and bungers keep harassing me. Hmm. Well, I'll be cold and buried before those walking appetizers make me go home starving. <laughs> Let's start with the fryer. Lure it down with ketchup, and then let me eat it. Okay, cool. Uh, I guess I'm... All right, cool. Oh, what is that? That, um, looks interesting. It's a shishka bug. Once this pest hides, it won't come out until hiding. It won't come out of hiding until it's forced out. These darn varmints ruined my farm. <laughs> nice. And it's interesting because it has like a, a tomato head and a weenie body and a mushroom butt. Oh, and our, its legs are like little toothpicks. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. Okay, cool. Then... This is the um, bunger. This bug snack knocks away traps. It also tackles anything covered in ketchup. I had a set of scarecrows just to give them something else to tackle. All right, cool. All right, uh, I guess we gotta look for the frider. Oh, these are some interesting cave ruins over here. Interesting. Oh, hello. Is that? Okay, that's a frider. Climbs into high walls without uh, out of reach, but will come down if it smells ketchup. Also, it's so interesting that his legs are little fries and its little head is like the little containers. 
uh, that you put like your ketchup and your sauces in. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Let's see. Let's see if we can do this. Seeing some ketchup right down there. There we go. Okay, I better switch to this real quick. There we go. Oh, hello. All right. There we go. We got a frider. Okay. Let's go feed this to Wham this real quick once I uh, hoard all this ketchup. There you go, sir. One frider coming up. All right. Okay, that's an interesting uh, French fry arm. Tastier than I thought. Now, I want to eat those darn shish bugs. <laughs> those pests are easy to spook, and they don't even like ketchup. Not sure why they bother with me. Figure out how to wrangle them. I'll be set. Okay, cool. Gotta get the shish kebabs now. According to this... Okay, they seem to hide. Okay, let's see if I can... Hmm. I wonder... So it just went into that bush. I wonder if... We can sing some ketchup on it. Come on, little bunger. Come on. Here's a tasty treat. Oh, okay, never mind. Alright. Um, it seems to have gone out. But maybe I need to put something down. Once it comes out. There we go. Okay. Okay, got one. Just need to get one more. See that one's over here. Alright, we need to get this thing out of here. We need to make a nice little ketchup trail for this bunger. Okay. All right, now we. Oh, what the? It went to the other bush. What the heck? Um, here, come here. Come on. There's more ketchup, please. There you go. Oh no, it's gonna go back in. It keeps coming back in. Okay, where is it? Did it go back in again? Uh... Where'd it go? The heck? Alright, it completely, like, disappeared for some reason. Maybe I can find another one over here. Uh... I don't know where it went. It, like... Went out of the bush and it was no longer there. Did I break the game? <laughs> let's go ahead and put that. Let's go ahead and scan it. Okay. Uh, let's throw down a trap. Wait. Here? Okay, then we need to scare it out of that whole bush. Come on, little bunger. Come on. I know you want this ketchup. There we go. Alright. Oh, shoot. Ah, dang it. I have I had my chance. Ow! Okay. That was cool, I guess. I forgot to switch to it. I could have easily gotten it if I had switched to it. Let's go ahead and put that down again. Alright. So maybe I just missed it going between the bushes. Um... And I just didn't. I just thought it just glitched out. Anyways, that doesn't matter. We're gonna go ahead and grab this real quick and take it back to Wambus. All right, there you go, sir. Here's another shishka bug coming right up. All right, cool. Ah, that's good eating. All right, last bit of business. Let's get revenge on those bungers. Oh, okay. They're too wily for your trap, but if you can get them all woozy and vulnerable, you can scoop them right up with this net. Okay, cool. Uh, you got the bug net. You can pick up bug snacks when they're stunned or vulnerable. Okay. 
Uh, press square on a nearby stunned bug snack to catch up with your bug net. All right, cool. All right, now I need to figure out how to catch this bunger. I wonder, huh. I'm gonna see if like, I have a little theory. There's two bungers. I wonder if they could both knock each other out. Let's see if I can make that happen real quick. Okay, that's not really working, as I thought. So now they're in close proximity to each other. What if I, what if I cover one of these in ketchup, since that Shishka bug was like covered? Nope. Uh, whoops. There we go. Nope. All right. Come on. Nope. Oh, whoops. I uh, accidentally catch up that tree. Okay, go get him, please. There we go. All right, net him. Cool. Nice, we got a bunger. There you go, sir. Go ahead and have this bunger. Honestly, I kind of want a hamburger right now. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Justice is served. Excuse you. That's dealt with for now, but they'll be back eventually. Well, I'm fixing to get my old garden growing again. Oh, you really mean it? Let's get moving right away. You know, you're a pretty good hunter. Like Philbo said, it's been <laughs> rough since Lisbeth vanished. Been rougher for some than others. Uh, hey, I sure could use help with this tree. Well, best not to dwell. Yeah. You hold on, I got this. All right. Yeah. Mess that tree up. Y'all just get along now. I'll catch him. Ha! Ha! That's funny. Okay. Let's go back to town. Oh, hello. Who are you? Hey there. Um. Like, Bethka? oh my God, is this squeeb really talking to me right now? I'm not a squeeb. <laughs> it says right here on my snack scope. Philbo, personality type, squeeb. Skills, none. Friends, none. It says that because you wrote that in yourself. It also says you're a terrible leader. I, you. Aw, Philbo. <laughs> like, are you still here? Zonk off, squeeb. Too bad. Philbo, it's okay. You have, I'm your friend. Okay, let's talk to Bethica. O-M-G. You're that journalist. I haven't seen a new face in like forever. I'm Bethica Winkle Snoot, and I know everything about everybody. Uh, more like Winkle Snob, if I should say so. Uh, can I help you? I love your snack scope. You and me are toads twinsies. <laughs> Let's put I bet emo you've seen lots the of great stuff. Let me take a peek at your journal. Uh, uh, I, I misplaced my journal. You lost your journal? Uh, yeah. No big deal. You can borrow one of mine. I keep them in my cave. Bring it here. I'll show you how it's done. Okay. All right. Uh, I guess I'll go into your little cave. Uh, uh, uh okay. So cool. You're, uh, you were playing some solitaire. Um, you were drawing a picture of a hot dog with hearts around it. Uh, you have a cute little backpack and a sleeping bag. Uh, and, uh, oh, here's the journal. Okay. Uh, what's this? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay. Anyways, let's go back to her. Okay, I have the journal. Way to play fetch. Okay, now open it up. Okay. Um, press the touchpad to open your journal. This is your bugpedia. Uh, here you can scroll through all the bug snacks you've scanned with your snack scope. You can also check on their likes, dislikes, and hints on how to catch them. Now check out the other pages to see what they're all about. Okay. This is your Grumpedia. It's like a Bugpedia, but for Grumpuses. Uh, this blank space will fill up with notes once you get to know each Grumpus better. Okay. All right, cool. Interesting. This is your clues page. It's where you'll keep all your progress in finding Lisbert. You can also select the clues to get a closer look at them. This is your quest list. You can get in-depth info on all your ongoing quests. You can also pin a quest to keep it visible while you're walking around. Okay. This is your snack pack. It's where you keep the bug snacks you've caught. This is your map of Snacktooth. It's a map. Okay, cool. 
Uh, this is your list of tools, just a way to keep track of all your snack catching gear. All right, that's everything. Okay, cool. This journal will be helpful. I'll see, everything you scan with the snack scope lines up in the journal. I have more for you to do, but Wambus is scaring all the snacks away. You'll have to come back later. Until then, you should get Bilbo out of here. Okay then, cool. Uh, can I feed you a snack? Here, you can have a sh couple of All right, um, I'm actually kind of curious. Can you actually take Oh, you can. Interesting. You can actually snap some. Uh, you can scan the grumpuses and learn more about them. Okay, cool. All right, let's get going, <sighs> Philbo. Let's get this over with, buddy. Okay, we are going into Snacksburg. Sounds pretty dope. Well, here we are. Okay. Um. Ooh, ooh, wait. It's a regular old ghost town. Hmm. I don't know what I expected. Without Lizbert around, nobody would want to come back here. Oh. It's not much, but it's still home. Let's get moving. Okay. Let's do so. Okay, I'm coming. I mean, this is a pretty quaint little town, and Wampus is Wampus is going to town on the cute little garden right there. Um, it could use, you know, it doesn't look lived in. You know, it could use more people, I guess. But I'm sorry. I guess you're not gonna get that interview with Lizbert just yet. It's okay. We'll get it eventually. Uh, why don't I interview you? Really? Me? I mean, if you want to, um, <laughs> ask away, I guess. Okay. All right, I guess we're conducting an interview. I, uh, got my little tape recorder on. Okay. Uh, who are you? I'm Philbo Fiddlepie. I guess I'm sort of like a deputy mayor. I don't know. Okay. I'm not good at most stuff, but I like to help out. You know what? It's thought that counts, so... All right, uh, why come to Snacktooth Island? Well, Lizbert asked me to tag along, so I dropped everything, and here I am. Uh, okay, uh, what is Philbo's relationship with Lizbert, then? If he was willing to drop everything. Okay, anyways, uh, thoughts on bug snacks? Oh, they're great. I mean, they taste good, and they make everybody happy, so what's not to love? I mean, I guess that's true. Uh, any info on Lizbert? Lizbert and me go way back. Lizbert was, is awesome. She always knew what to do, and she brought out the best in all of us. She'd leave me in charge of watching Snacksburg when she went out hunting. Hmm. Okay, uh, so that's how you became there? I mean, I wasn't really in charge. Nobody took me seriously. But as long as Lizbert came back with bug snacks, everything was fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, what happened to Snacksburg? One day, Lizbert went out hunting and she didn't come back. I tried to step up and keep everybody calm. Well, technically, I was in charge, right? But uh, that didn't last long. Okay, uh, why didn't it last? There was a big fight, and then an earthquake, and then everybody decided they'd be better off alone. Hmm. They couldn't even keep us together for one day. I honestly don't know what Lisbeth saw in me. Oh, it's okay, buddy. Okay. Um, I think we're done. Okay. Uh, sorry, buddy. I didn't want to bum you out. Lisbeth might be gone, but you're here now. Nobody listened to me, but but you? You're pretty good at stuff, and well. Nobody hates you yet. Yet. You can catch bug snacks. <laughs> That's a big and yet. And bring everybody back to Snacksburg. Once they're here, you can do some more interviews and figure out what happened to Lisbert. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, where should I start? You should find Gramble on the beach. If we get his ranch going again, that'll be a big help. Oh, okay. You could also go back and talk to Befica, I guess. <laughs> anyway, I'll be here if you need any advice. All right. Says that Good reluctantly. Good luck, buddy. All right, cool. All right, here we are. We're in Snacksburg. Um, 
And it looks like Philbo has lit a fire. Uh, can I sit down? No, it's okay. I can just stand by this nicely lit warm fire and just stare into Philbo's eyes and just just get lost in that deep purple. But anyways, that is where we're going to end the episode. So this has been Bug Snacks, and so far I really like this game. I'm very much surprised with how the story is progressing. It seems to be going into some kind of darker territory that's not really common with these kind of games because you wouldn't really expect that from like the art style. I don't know. I like that though. I like when games like this can tackle tough subject matter. I don't know. It makes it more appealing in my opinion. But I really like the gameplay. It's very reminiscent of like Pokemon Snap or something like that. I love the look of this game. Like it looks super pretty. You know, it's got a unique visual art style, so. But yeah, overall, I enjoyed my time playing this game, so uh, I hope you guys did too. If you guys would like to see this game return as a series, please sure to let me know. Uh, I would love to come back and uh, play more of this uh, within the coming weeks. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you are already subscribed, make sure to ring that notification bell so you are updated whenever more videos go live. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I will see you guys next time. Janet!